Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. Today we have a super exciting video. I'm finally bringing you another updated curly hair routine, but this time it is my travel curly girl routine. So if you didn't know, I'm currently in Adelaide. I've been here for three weeks um, and I've got a little bit over one week to go. So I'm here with Billy Elliot touring with the musical. It's so much fun and it's actually my first time living alone as well. So I wanted to show you guys what I bought with me to Adelaide. I didn't bring an excessive amount of products, but I bought products that I knew I could trust and rely on. So that's why I wanted to show you what they are. I love these products. They are my go-to. They work every single time and um, yeah, they're just amazing. So I'm gonna show you the products right now before we hop into the styling routine. Um, and in the styling routine today, I only used two products. So I love you guys. Thank you so much for watching. And if you want to see these bomb results, make sure you continue to watch and check out my Instagram too. All right, let's get straight into the video. So this is what I bought for the shower. I literally only bought the Bondi Boost Curl Boss Shampoo and Conditioner. Have been loving these two so much. This is just my body wash and my face wash. So I've been really loving them. They are curly girl friendly, sulfate, paraben, and um, silicone free, Australian made, and they're also vegan and cruelty free. So they're amazing products. I really, really do recommend these, and they're literally the only things I've been using besides my Christoph Robin cleansing, oh, Christoph Robin cleansing purifying scrub with sea salt. I use this on days when my hair's are really oily and my scalp's itchy. So maybe once every two weeks, I like to just add a little bit of this treatment but before I use this shampoo and I just think it really helps to get rid of any product buildup and any dandruff. So those are the products I have been using for my shower. That's literally it. So this is all the hair products I bought. I bought with me my very trusty Bond Repair Leave-In Treatment Mousse from um, Alterna. You guys know I love this mousse. It's been a favorite of mine for a while and I really feel like it is a great product if I only want to style my hair with one product. So I don't need to use anything else when I use this mousse. It's definitely a staple for me. Um, I love it. And then I bought these two products with me as well. The BB Curl Conditioning Mousse and the Bondi Boost um, Curl Boss Styling Cream. And these are what I'm going to use in my um, routine today. So stay tuned to see how I use them. And then the last pair of products I got were the Briogeo Curl Charisma line. So this is the um, Quinoa Gel and the Defining Cream. I actually haven't used these as much as I thought I would. I probably could have done with leaving them at home, but they are still really good products that I do like. Um, besides that, the only other things I bought to tame my hair is just this basic spray bottle. I just filled it up with water when I got here. And yeah, it just really helps my styling process. And then also my diffuser, which I will reintroduce later on in the video, as well as... Did I bring it back in here? Oh yeah. As well as the Denman brush, my Tangle Teaser from, my wet detangler from Tangle Teaser. I used this today in the shower, so it's a bit wet. But yeah, that's literally all I bought. Okay guys, so I popped out of the shower. I put a little bit of makeup on. Um, and now I'm just gonna put a robe on because as I've mentioned several times on my channel, I freaking hate the way wet hair feels on your back. Gross, so I just like to keep a robe. Anyway, hydrate. So I showed you all of the products that I bought to Adelaide today. I've selected two. So I'm going to be using the Bondi Boost the Bondi Boost Styling Cream um, from their Curl Boss range, alongside the BB Curl Conditioning Mousse from Bumble and Bumble. I love these two together because the Bondi Boost um, Styling Cream is super hydrating and really defining, but it really just moisturizes my curls, which is what I need, especially in summer. And then the mousse gives a great hold and definition. So these together are a really great pair, but I don't want to overload my hair because then it gets oversaturated and too heavy. So a little bit of both is kind of a really great combination for my 3AB curls. So first things first. Kind of just like any other hair routine I've done, except I just wanted to really show you what I do for traveling. Okay, so this is the hair brushed out. So now I'm going to go in with the... I'm going to take probably about this much. I feel like a little goes a long way with this product. It's super great. Um, I think it's great for all hair types. I just don't want to oversaturate my hair with it, even though it's not overly thick, which I really like. So... Um, don't put this in the roots of your hair. I'll make it really heavy. 
mainly just from here down the lengths. It just makes my hair so soft straight away, so moisturized. I think the bottoms is just lacking a little bit of moisture, so I'm going to just add a bit more in the bottoms. They really need a trim. So now that that's done, I'm going to go in with just the next product, which is my final product. But I'm going in with the BB Curl Mousse. I've loved this mousse. It gives me such good hold. It's amazing, especially for a night out. Starting small and building up. So I'm going to scrunch in that mousse. And you like that sound. That is a good sound. <laughs> I really like this mousse because it's not heavy. It's really quite light. So you can build it up really well without making your hair heavy. I'm gonna flip my hair over now and continue the scrunching process, so. Alrighty, so flipping it back over. As you saw, that was super easy. Basically just ran this through my hair and then scrunched this through my hair. You've got two options. You can air dry your hair or you can diffuse. Um, I have been air drying quite a lot lately, but today there's a few things I want to do. I need to get out of this apartment, so I'm going to diffuse my hair. I definitely bought my diffuser with me. That is just one thing I cannot live without, especially um, when I'm always rushing around doing a million things a day. I don't have time to always sit home and air dry my hair. So that's why I'm diffusing. The diffuser I've been using recently, you probably would have seen it in a few of my videos, is this GHD diffuser. Um, it's really great. It's got a cool blast setting. It's got three speed settings for the wind. I mean two. So it's got two. And then it's got three um, heat settings. So no heat, medium heat, and then really hot. I really never do, I never use the really, really hot one. I just kind of bounce between no heat and then the medium setting. I'm just gonna start by running the diffuser around my curls and not touching them yet because I don't want to disturb the natural curl pattern just yet. Okay, so when your hair starts to get more dry, you can M up the speed a little bit and start kind of cupping your curls to move the process along I am about maybe 70% dry right now I'm gonna hype it up a little bit more and hype it up ramp it up now it's time for that shake you know I love a shake Shaking really just separates the curls and gives you that volume. Three, two, one. Damn. Okay guys, and there we have it. Oh my God. I, I mean, I think the results speak for themselves. These products together are and it's such an easy, simple routine. Two products, no brushing needed, just scrunching. <laughs> Guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, I will link the products below. Um, give them a try and comment below if you do end up trying them and what you think of them. I am super obsessed with this um, routine and these results. Make sure you subscribe to my channel. Come back for more videos. I have them every single week. Bye, guys. Have a great day.